Hey Brunchers, this is Richard and today we're going to show the new recording system. And the new recording system can be used by either webinars or meetings. And you're going to notice this new icon here, record. And once you click here, you will see this icon for start your recording. Once you click here, the next step is to choose if you want to record your entire, your entire screen and a window or your Chrome tab. Usually, we recommend you to record your Chrome tab. However, if you need to navigate between your tabs during your session, then you can share your window. Once you're ready, just choose your window and click here on Share. Once you start recording, as you can see here, it's flashing. It's indicating that it's recording already. And then you can pause if you want at any specific time. Or you can just stop here to end your session. If you click here on pause, you can resume your recording at any time. And if you want to end your session, just click here to stop. And this will just ask you if you want to end your recording, just click on yes. And yeah, now you're ready to start a new one if you want to. You can assign moderators or co-organizers to record in your behalf. And let's say we want to assign Andy. Just click here on the chat, type at, and then you're going to see the list of all your attendees. And then by clicking here on this yellow button, once it turns to yellow, it means like Andy it's a co-organizer of this session and he will be able to record if you are not recording at the exact same moment. Either way, once you click here on this icon, you, you will see all the recordings that you have done in this particular session and the status of each one of them. And once it's available, you're going to see here available and we can see here who has recorded. And then by clicking here, you can download your recording file or just generate a shareable link, just like a Dropbox link. And then you can share with your attendees. In addition, you will receive an email notifying that your recording is available. You don't have to keep waiting. As much as now, it's way faster than before to process your recording. But yeah, you can just wait this email here. And this email will notify that your recording is available. And by clicking here in this link, it will direct you to GoBrunch. And then you can just start downloading your, your video file. And this is cool, guys. The new recording system allows you to reuse your session as many times as you want. And then what you can do is you can upload all your files, materials, and documents once. And just leave it here as your repository. You can upload your presentations here. And you can create your breakout sessions in advance. You can replace your background for each one of your sessions. And lastly, you can customize your link and make it unique and share with your attendees. Once your session is over, all you have to do is click here on Rooms and Sessions, click to Edit, and then you can just change the date here, click Update, just updating our session for the upcoming one. With this new recording system, you are now in full control of what you are recording. And keep in mind that the audio recording feature is no longer available and you have to click here in order to start your recordings. And that's all for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed and we see you in the next one.